Here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can add a before after section into your Shopify store. So basically you are interested to display this feature for your customers so that people could able to compare and able to buy the products. So I have already written a blog post. You just need to copy and paste the code. So I am going to refresh this page and you can see that the section has been removed. So I'm going to show you how you can do it step by step. You should go to the dashboard of the store. I have installed down theme. If you have any other free theme, then same steps will be applied if you are using any other theme then you can try this and if facing any issue i will help you out in that so you should click on these three dots click on duplicate so once you are duplicating it then you should click on edit code here we have some folders and files so you should go back to the documentation we have to create a new section and name of that section should be before dash after so you should copy the name and click on sections click on add a new section and paste the name here and then click on done then after you should copy the code from here and then firstly remove this code and paste the new code and then click on save go back to the dashboard of the store again and here you should click on customize here in the customize section you should click on add section and here you should search before and here we go you can click on before after section and you can see that this is how it will look at the initial stage and here you should click on card and then click on image you can choose the images i have already uploaded the images so i'm going to choose from here so for example this one here we go Now you can save the changes and if you wanted to change the text or maybe customer name so you can change it uh, here update the description which you are interested to uh, display here and you can change the images like I did then click on save so here we have view all option so you can uh, disable this and then click on save once the changes are saved then you can actually refresh it back and here we go now you can see that we have before and after section added here if you wanted to reduce the size of this title you can actually go back and click on here and then you can actually uh, put it in the small and if you wanted to make them bold select it and click on bold so that's how it will look like the one which we added before so for example you are interested to add only three so you can actually remove one maybe for example i am removing this and then after you should click here you should reduce number of products to three and then click on save and then you can actually refresh it back all right if you wanted to change the label of before after then that is also possible so here we have uh, the settings we have before and after so you can uh, change from here from here and from here okay so that's how you can update the things enable that sliding here enable carousel slider enable swipe on mobile let me refresh it back here we go now you can see that we have sliding all right so one more thing is that you can see there is a shadow so you can change the color of this shadow also so let me show you here you can see that we have border co border color so if you wanted to change it to for example green so you can see that the green is displaying so let me see the preview here we go now you can see that we have green uh, shadow so you can update to any other color so thank you so much for watching this video if you're new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video if you are facing any issue or you need to create any kind of uh, new feature so i'm happy to help you out in that thank you once again see you in the next video